And it goes a little yeah. something like What if I told you I couldn't stay? Take me or leave me. You can still walk away. What if I told you? Oh my god! What? <laughs> my baby just asked me to marry him in such a pretty place. Only in Alaska. Do you come to say happy birthday, Moosey? Our puppy loves his best friend. He's playing with my dad on Call of Duty. Okay, can you, I'm just turning up. Family Bondi. All right, can you hear me? Okay, I was just testing that, I'm raising my one volume. Good damn day, guys. It is Sunday, September 13th, and it is actually my birthday, and we are here to start another weekly vlog. So last week I took vlogging off just because I had some other videos that I was uploading. So we're back in full swing, but I just came on to say I got something exciting in the mail. So last week was Labor Day weekend and Laura Lee Los Angeles had a little Labor Day sale and her nudie patootie palette was on sale for, I think it was $20 and it's originally like 45. Um, so I picked that up and I'm really excited about it. First off, I really love her packaging. I like the, it's pretty sleek, nice and narrow. It's kind of like a little, I don't know. I like this. I just like the style of it. Also, I love that she incorporated a mirror in this bitch. Hell yeah, girl. And first off, let's just say this palette is beautiful. So I just wanted to do like a first impressions on it because I've never used her makeup before and... I'm curious. So we're just gonna do a little bit of just a simple eye look. So let's go. The first color I'm dipping in is the one called Bear. It's like a pinky color. She's a Mona Lisa. She does have some fallout though. Streaking. She's a Mona Lisa. So the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go into Butt Naked. Then we're gonna go into Nakey Nakey and a little bit of reveal. And then I'm gonna go back in with Bear, that pink color, and Streaking. Then on the lower lash line, I'm gonna do Butt Naked. can't decide which one of these I want to do. I think we're going to do Jaybird, which is this pretty rose gold. Okay, girl. She ain't playing. Okay. So that rose gold color is insane. It's beautiful. I'm sure that the all natural is too, but I'm in love with that Jaybird color. Oh my God. It, it's not even coming across on camera like it is in, our, in, real, in real life. It's so pretty. I love it. I love it. All in all, chef's kisses. Worth it. Worth it. Loving it. Hell yeah. She done did the damn thing. Okay, bye. I checked in with you earlier and we were trying out Laura Lee's palette. But a lot has happened since then. Like, my parents gave me a gift card to Old Navy and... Your girl needed some business outfits for work. So, thankfully, Old Navy be having a sale. They hooked a sister up. So, I got um, a couple different things. And I figured, why not show you guys? So, the very first thing I got was actually for my boyfriend. He is a pizza maniac. I got him some pizza socks because I love him to bits and he loves pizza. So, you want a pizza me? The next thing I got, my business homies would know. If I, I used to work at a bank and now I work 
somewhere else and I've always had to wear like professional outfits. I can't just wear jeans to work every day. Although because of COVID I can. So there's one saving grace right now. It is that I can wear jeans to work whenever I want. But I always, I swear by Old Navy's pixie pants. Love their pixie pants. So they're just, I'm pretty short. I have really short legs. There, Old Navy's pixie pants fit me right. They also make your butt look really good, so just saying. But they are the best quality work pants I can find as a as a girl that I'm not spending three million trillion dollars on. So that's pretty awesome. So I got two pairs of those. These were on sale for $15 each, and hell, that's a steal because usually these ones specifically are $34.99, and usually the other ones, the ones that are a little bit nicer, are generally $39.99. Anyway, the next thing I got was actually this cute little tank top. Um, I got it in a size large, but it's a little bit flowy. She's cute and fun, and she's got this nice little floral print on it, but I figured why not? This will be good for summer next year, and it'll also be good to just kind of wear under some cardigans. So I picked up one of those in the floral print, and then I also grabbed a cheetah print one that is actually v-neck and it's a bit flowy. She's really cute and she's got like a little cutlet on the back like, hello. Anyway, thought she was really cute too. I don't really own much leopard print. My mom was obsessed with leopard and cheetah print. I don't know which one's the difference. I think this is leopard. The last couple things I got, um, I'm a sucker for cardigans, especially because fall is coming up. Freaking Old Navy had their cardigans on sale for $12. So, the first one I got is this cute cream tan color. I got this, this one. Then, you think that's not it? I got it also in pink. This nice blush pink color. Love her. And then, I also got her in black. Because why the flip not? I can do what I want. Anyway, I'm gonna go now because I don't know what my boyfriend's doing outside, but it's driving me crazy. Me out to dinner for my birthday. Hey, cute boy. I love you. Hello. I like the view. You're my best view. Get in my belly! Come on! Hello, guys. So. For my birthday, my boyfriend got me something that I'm way too excited about. If anyone knows me personally, they know that more than anything in this entire universe, I love Post Motherfucking Malone. If you look on my channel, you'll see a video where I have turned myself into Post Malone as a recreation of my Halloween costume. So, Finally, in Alaska, we have been able to find Maison 9 wine, which is Post Malone's wine. So, I have a bottle of it chilled. It is a rosé wine, which I don't really ever drink rosé, but we do have a bottle of it chilled. So, we're going to try that. First thing I got to say is the packaging on this mother trucker is hella nice. Like, that's a glass cork. Like, have y'all ever seen that before? Because I haven't. That's the rich, rich. That's the bougie bouge. I mean, she looks nice. I don't even drink rose wine, but I would drink it if it looked like this probably. I don't I don't know. Anyway, let me pour some glasses and I'll get back to you in a minute. Hello guys. So we're back with some pulled glasses of some rose. What's the what's the notes on your on your smeller? Rose? Yeah, it <laughs> literally does just smell like rose. I don't I don't know all those floral fruity things. I'm not it a It smells like a flower blooming in the Midwest, I would say. Somewhere forty degrees, maybe fifty. I don't know. Why would a flower be blooming in forty degree weather, baby? That's the beauty of it. I don't know. But being a whining, you know. A whiny? Yeah. A wino? A whiny. They call them sommeliers. Um, they're anyway. full of it. Cheers, excuse Cheers. me. 
Very dry. Yeah. <laughs> Drier than the Sahara Desert. <laughs> but she's... Yeah! Rosé! If you like rosé, you'll probably like it. I'm not a super fan of rosé. I'm going to stick one that's a little better. Still just as dry. A little bitter. I feel like it's good quality wine. Yeah. I just wouldn't go out of my way for it. That's all. But I'm going to keep the bottles. Good damn, bottle. good damn day, everybody. It is Thursday sometime in September. I've lost track of days. Um, but I know it's Thursday at least because I've been living perpetually all week thinking it's a day ahead. Anyway, today at work, one of my friends sent me a mobile gift card to Starbucks and it happened to be the best time ever because one of my coworkers said she went to Starbucks the other day and she ordered a drink because she used to work at a Starbucks. So she's used to like mixing it up. So she ordered a grande kiwi starfruit refresher and she put peach juice in it and coconut milk and she said it was really good so i got it and let's try it let's see if it's something delicious delightful and something new that we can try out mm. Ooh. Mm. you want to try it let's see what bubby thinks it's a little Smart. sour pretty no, sour i like it it's good y'all so get a grande kiwi ice hold on so get an ice grande kiwi star fruit refresher add coconut milk and add peach juice <laughs> chef's kisses delish what are you giggling about over there boy Bye, he keeps farting my fiance dalton is currently in the grocery store getting tomatoes and a birthday card because he didn't get one yet so thanks baby for getting it almost a week later but you know better late than never anyway i asked him to get mac and cheese and i'm just making this to see if he really does come back with mac and cheese because i hope he does i really want mac and cheese anyway um this week's vlog has been pretty much non-existent because I kind of forgot. We just have a lot going on. It's just been a busy week. My my fiance's been doing hay and I have just been kind of living my best life, enjoying our engagement and stuff like that and just taking time for us, which I think is the most important thing. I just haven't really been picking up a camera to do that kind of stuff just because I want to spend some time and if he's out doing hay, we don't really have time to just sit and vlog. And I don't really know what I want to vlog about anyway right now. I haven't been doing anything, so I feel like I can't be like, Oh, I went to Target because I didn't. I didn't do anything. I've just been sitting at home cleaning. And I don't think you guys want to see me do laundry. I don't want to see me do laundry. I don't even want to be present when I'm doing laundry. So I don't want y'all to have to be there. But anyway, yeah, so... I'll check in and see if he gets me mac and cheese. Fingers crossed he did. Y'all, mm, I'm marrying the best man ever one day. Literally, I went to the store once and said, this is my favorite mac and cheese there is. I was like, I don't ever get it because it's way more expensive than normal. This is like $4 a box. Whereas you can get boxes for like $2.50 or less. So he got me my favorite one. And then he also gave me, he boy gave me variety in case I wasn't feeling white cheddar. He also got rich and creamy four cheese. Oh, he loves me. Yes. I love mac and cheese and I love him. And Chef's kisses. Okay, bye. So I just got home and my Amazon package arrived and I'm really excited. I'll tell you why in just a second. Because we've got a wedding planner. Uh, this one had really good reviews <clears throat> on Amazon. So let me see. Let's open it. Let's open it, shall we? Pip, pip, cheerio, one moment. 
Okay, this is what it looks like. The wedding of, oh, it's got like a little folder. Oh, cute. I'll link this down in the description below too. Nice, this gives you like a list of everything you need to be thinking about. Choose your bridal party. They have eight. Oh, plus a. So the amount I have right now would fill this all up. <laughs> Trying to eliminate. But I don't want to eliminate people, but just kind of trying to see how many is too many. How many is too many? Married people, let me know. How many bridesmaids are too many? going to the cutest coffee shop. Is it the best one? No. Is it the cutest one? Yes. 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 Happy Saturday. What did we just do, baby? Are um, we allowed to talk about it? Um, yeah, we went and saw Moosey's. We went and saw baby Moosey's. So, at a, like, moose concert. It's a conservation, so. Yeah. You get to just look at them, you can't, like, pet them and stuff. Because, yeah, you, you know, they got to release them back in the wild soon. But it's cool to be able to at least be near them. Yeah, and when I would put my mask on, they would come running up at me. I think it's because they would probably, like, what the hell's on her face? Like, mm -hmm. what, what is that? Because my mask's a little wild. But, yeah, so we went to the moose conservation, and we got to be up close and see them but you can't really touch them but one moose kept putting his face like pretty close to mine so I was just like beep, 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 beep. so yeah we are going to grab some coffee enjoy the day probably relax watch some shows and yeah but until next time good damn day everybody it is Monday September something and I am just jumping on to end the vlog I am sorry this week wasn't the most fun vlog there ever was but it's kind of like we got engaged my birthday happened and then suddenly I wake up and it's like 10 days later and I just don't even remember I don't know it's been such a blur so yeah until next week good damn bye <laughs>